Hey guys, how's it going? We have the NHL 18 Community Team of the Year here. Um, as you see here, uh, Community Team of the Year uh, are their nominees. So uh, last year we could pick whoever we wanted. Um, there was many CHL players. Uh, there was Trig V Miniguns, who plays in the WHL. Um, Mason Raymond, who plays overseas, who's a fan favorite pretty well everywhere that he plays. Um, yeah, but this year, they are only giving you four players of each position to choose from. Like, you only select four, but they're giving you 12. So, uh, here today, I am going to select my players with you guys. Um... These are made of players who don't have any Team of the Week cards, primetime cards, basically any special cards from throughout the year. Whether it be they haven't performed well enough to get one, or that they've been injured, or uh, something along the lines of that. So with that being said, uh, let's select our our four centers here. Um, laptops don't die, but we will still make it through this video very easily. Um, Carefoot, who's from the Colorado Avalanche. I'm not sure who this guy is. Uh, yeah, don't quote me on that. Um, but before anything, I want to get it out to you guys. Vote for Bo Horvat. He has been, uh, well, when he's been healthy, he's been injured for the first part of the season majority. But when he was playing, um, he was playing absolutely unreal. One of the Canucks best forwards by far. Um, definitely, uh, being a Cox fan, uh, it sucked to see him go down. Um, but since he's been back, he's been pl playing great. Him and Brock Besser together, great one-two punch for the future for the Canucks. Another one that I'd like to see is probably Jeff Carter. Um, he's actually had a solid year, um, kind of gone under the radar a lot, but he's been having a pretty solid year. Um, Nolan Patrick, just because, you know, he's a rookie, definitely not uh, going to be rookie of the year. Uh, not as, uh, probably not having the best rookie season, but I don't know. I feel like uh, if we if we got him in the, in the game as a team of the year uh, with a massive boost to his card, uh, I feel like a lot of people would use him. I feel like he'd probably have an unreal shot, some good checking. Uh, subpar defense, mediocre skating, and some pretty good hands. Um, and for the last one, you know, I'm not 100% uh, sure. I mean, we could go for Kerfoot, uh, this guy, Stastny, Monaghan. Um, but for the fact that Sean Monaghan has had one of the, one of the best uh, years of his career and a low key one of the best years of his career. Um, he has so many game winning goals, overtime game winners. Um, there's time he had like three or four straight game winning goals. Um, so yeah, we're gonna we're gonna select Sean Monahan with that. Uh, let's go to our right wingers here. Pasternak's an obvious one. Um, Dadnov is putting up a point per game coming over from the KHL. Uh, Surprisingly, Tarasenko has never had a Team of the Week card this year. I mean, he hasn't played all the best, but definitely uh, definitely worth probably a Team of the Year. And you know what? We're Jordan Eberle, I believe. Definitely having a pretty solid season coming over. Uh, first year in the Long Island. I mean, yeah, he's probably... I can't remember who he's playing with. Probably Tavares and... Uh, um, Bailey, but regardless of the fact, um, Panarin, Keller, okay, we're gonna go with Keller, because he started the year so hot, but it's kind of dropped off, Vanek has 40-some points, whoever he is with the Canucks, uh, a little bias there, but I mean, definitely, uh, definitely having a great year, um, Tatar for the Vegas Golden Knights, and Philip Forsberg. Uh, those are my uh, four picks there. Uh, for the right D, Green has been having a pretty good year. 
definitely showing why he uh, he got signed to that deal by the Red Wings, even though they're horrible. And I don't know why they didn't move him when they could have. Uh, a Justin Schultz Team of the Year card would honestly probably be on my team for like ever. Uh, he's honestly such a good player. Uh, Truba, Dumba, or Ellis. Um, probably Truba. He's actually been having a pretty solid year, even though um, he had that uh, contract issue. Um, I feel like a Zdeno Chara Team of the Year card would honestly probably be just so OP. Um, Josh Morrissey. It's funny, I, my girlfriend's mom actually met his parents at the airport the other day. Um, so that'd be pretty cool. And I'm going to go with a Dion Phaneuf card. You know, people are hating on him for being a pylon, but he's actually not all that bad. And uh, Flurry for sure. And I don't know, Ben Bishop. I feel like a Ben Bishop Team of the Year card would be pretty OP. So yeah, we're going to go with that. Now let's uh, let's submit these answers. Uh, but yeah, honestly, this this video is mostly uh, to get uh, Bo Horvat in the team of the year. Um, being a Canucks fan, it sucked to see him go down at the beginning of the year. Um, but in reality, he uh, he's been so good when he's been in the lineup. Uh, definitely deserves the team of the year card along with uh, the majority of those other cards or other players. My apologies. Um, yeah, also, the uh, the cards are looking really nice. Um, I can't, I don't have a picture of it or anything, but I'm sure if you look around, uh, you can find pictures of it, or even if you just watch the trailer, but if I uh, do that, I'll, my video will get taken down. I don't want that to happen. Um, but within saying that, um, yeah, it's, let's you start using the hashtag, go for Bo. Um, get him out there, tag him. Hopefully you can see, uh, one of my tweets. Uh, my Twitter link will be in the description below along with this, uh, this article here in case you guys don't know how to find it. Uh, it'll be on, I'll put it on Instagram as well. Uh, follow my Instagram. I put my Instagram, uh, username. I believe it's on my channel. Um, if not, you can just find me. Uh, the Civ underscore YT. Uh, definitely follow me there for like Fortnite videos, NHL videos, updates, when I'm streaming, etc. Uh, but with that being said, uh, this is the end of the video. Hashtag go for Bo, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. I kill this shit even though I'm broke. Yeah, the money moving slow. I'm the spirit. Cause the 9 to 5 I'm working is a joke. Give me money, fool. It made me wanna slip my throat. It made me wanna go and sell dope with my niggas.